Now, the change of base formula is actually enabled by the power law. For example, if I have log base b of a, I know that it's equal to e. Well, I could just rearrange this because I know that means that b to the exponent e is going to be equal to a. Now, if I want, I can take the log of both of these sides, and everything should be all right as long as I pay attention to my restrictions. Now, I haven't specified what the base is. Normally, it's base 10, but it could be base anything. Now, I know that my exponent rules basically tell me this exponent can come down in front of the log. So e times the log of b is going to be equal to the log of a. And with a little help from our old friend algebra, I just have to rearrange this to come up with my expression for e. And so there we go. I have e is equal to the log of a divided by the log of b. And this particular log is the same base. Normally 10, but not necessarily. 